started ballet at the age of two at a local dance school. As soon as I could properly talk, I was telling my mum that ballet is what I wanted to do when I was older. I am still following that dream. When I was roughly five years old, I looked up to and admired the older dancers, just wishing I could be like them. I pushed myself to get the most advanced numbers and achieve the highest grades that I possibly could. In order to gain more experience, I began auditioning and as a result was able to perform in some small ensemble roles. My first serious competition was at the age of nine, after many years of practice already. My first competition, my first win. After this, I did more and more stage shows, getting bigger and bigger roles, and even the chance to perform solo in regional youth ballet. I was gifted a huge bouquet of flowers as lead dancer. However, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Going to dance school was the beginning of the roller coaster ride that is ballet. There is no time off at dance school. One day in class, I was overwhelmed by an enormous pain in my knee. Tears started flowing, but I couldn't let my teachers see my suffering, so I pushed through and continued dancing. Class had finished, my knee was swollen and the pain was immense, so I decided that I needed to go to physio. It turns out that I had almost completely dislocated my kneecap. I had to strap my knee for four months. To ensure that I didn't miss class, I made sure to painfully exercise my knee every single night. My knee was healing and getting stronger, then boom. I started developing shin splints whilst working on the famous ballet Giselle. A lot of ballet dancers complain about this issue, so there's not much sympathy. It's part of the job. Nine months down the line and my legs are still pained and are constantly taped up. I'm at a dance school nine till six every day, often eight till six for extra classes. So I have the evening at home to try and fix myself and rest before the next day of intense classes start. This industry is a huge mental challenge. One moment you can be up at the top of your world, ready to take on absolutely anything that the world could throw at you. But the next, you hate the sight of point shoes and the idea of ever putting a pair on again, broken. I have been subject to a lot of stress. My whole class of toned and small girls were told to lose weight or we won't ever get a job. Oh, and the fact that I look like a serial killer when I dance. After rehearsing for Giselle every day with a damaged knee and painful shins, turning up early and finishing late, I performed in front of my principals. The director tore me apart. They said they could not believe that I would dance to that low of a standard. Ballet has truly been my life for 16 years and more to come. I dance to entertain and for the happiness of others. The excruciating pain, the overall exhaustion, the emotional challenges and the self-sacrifice. It's all worth it when you see the happiness you can bring to others. People often say I was born to dance. I agree.